What's the deal, YouTube? It's your boy NextGen720, and I am back with another video. And before I start today's video, if you haven't checked out my last few videos, I'll leave the link down below. Uh, shout out to the influx of the new subscribers I got. Thank you guys for rocking out with me doing uh, this prestigious E3 week. Um, also, swing by the Big Gamer Small Talk podcast. Swing by our website. The website is growing. Join the forums. We're looking to get that thing bigger than NeoGAF. Um, check out some of the t-shirts, uh, you know what I mean, um, you know, with the unofficial member, my brother, uh, Jay Williams, man, uh, shout out to him, I'm checking out, oh, this game is beautiful, this is, this is, um, Fulgore, me, uh, General Ram, uh, you know, on Killer Instinct, if you're an Xbox fan, or if you're even into fighters, you know what I mean, there's no way in hell, like, you should not have, uh, this game, but I'm not gonna, let me get into this, let me get into the, um, the actual video what I want to do this video is about. So anyway, I know that which is Reyes. I know that, you know, Phil and you know Aaron and those guys know who we are. Um at the end of the day, you know, um uh if you don't well even with me, if you don't know, like I said, I was probably one of the first, if not the first, uh guy here on YouTube and just say go say on the crumb side of YouTube, you know, representing for us Xbox fans. Because like I said at the end of the day, it's been hard being a, a, a uh it's been hard being an Xbox fan. Uh this generation has been hard. You know what I mean? Um it's been hard being an Xbox fan. We don't get to enjoy on our exclusives, you know what I mean? Every even if Microsoft releases a beta, a digital foundry or something, you know, it's running like it's really been hard being an Xbox fan this generation. And so sometimes, like I said, I'll, and I give Phil crap sometimes. I know Phil doesn't curse. So I'm not going to try to curse in this video. Because Phil, this video is for you, for you, Phil. Phil reminds me of some time of Mr. Rogers that lives on Elm Street. And his neighbor is Freddy Krueger. His other neighbor is Michael Myers. You know what I mean? I give Phil crap. Like I said, Phil is just too nice. You know, um, you know, like I would say, like I would say, Microsoft, Phil, be the behemoth that you guys are. You know what I mean? Go out there and crush the competition. Like I like and, and I and I, and I stand by firm by this. Like I feel as though all of Microsoft's wounds have been self inflicted this generation. Even going back to down to the reveal, uh, when it came out and it, it wasn't a problem that us gamers feel had a problem with the T V stuff. It's just that the hardcore gamers such as myself and you know, everyone else, we took off work or whatever the case may be. I had a hot date with a granny probably canceled my date uh and 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 you know took a work to see the console the reveal and you know 90 percent of your guys reveal was about television and again for gamers and you're going to say oh no sony's all about the gamers just about no listen the, no one just buys these quote unquote these next generation consoles or whatever just to play games the ps3 was in the genesis book of world records if i'm not mistaken for the number one used device as far as netflix you know what i mean so it it, it, it again it wasn't the problem with the TV stuff, you know what I mean? It's just that sometimes you guys misread the audience, uh, you know what I mean? Um, but, like I said, I always give Phil crap about him being too nice, and I like the Phil that I saw at E3. He seemed confident. Um, I'm Like I said, it was a proud day for us Xbox fans, you know what I mean? In the perfect world, we can do this all day about who have the better games or whatever. The case. I don't mind. That's a healthy conversation. There, there will always be a console war. People have to justify their purchase whatever you know what i mean in the day it's free advertisement i don't mind but sometimes this stuff does go left um a lot of time you know us on big game or small talk or whatever we get blamed for a lot of stuff you know what i mean or trust me I, it's not that serious next gen 720 is just a character i come here to have fun with games you know i get all i mean i'm quite you get, I'm, i feel i'm nobody i'm a small potato in this pot of stew like say this youtube stew and i get a lot of crap you know, and I'm nobody. That's why I imagine what you get. So that's why I don't talk about, I don't want to tune the tweet you guys or whatever. You know what I mean? I don't. I, I don't. Unless it's something really, really important. But like I said, I've given you crap in the past about you being too nice. And I, I'm reading this article here. Phil Spencer says uh, Microsoft ships more exclusives than Sony. Phil Spencer has some rather stern remarks regarding Sony recently. First, he said that Microsoft was shipping more exclusives this year. Which, if you go by the count, is true. Secondly, he criticized Sony's conference for showing games with no, with, which might release in 2018 and beyond. Hey, Phil, I got to give you the golf clap on that one. 
I'm on some like, oh, you ever, hey, Phil, you ever seen The Last Dragon before with Bruce Lee Boy? May God forgive me if I have to use my art. That's what I'm talking about, Phil. You know what I mean? You know, that's what I'm talking about. You know what I mean? You, you, you listen, and then you broke out the Scorpio. Because listen, let's be real. Um, this, this E3, Sony bought the games, Microsoft bought the hardware because this whole entire generation has been about power. Pixel counting, I think it's the craziest thing in the world for console gamers to be arguing about resolution in frames per second. When 99.9% .9 of the PlayStation 3 library was sub HD. But we didn't talk about, we went back and forth who had the better games. You know what I mean? But now, once the more powerful Scorpio comes out, Microsoft takes the crown by having the more powerful console, then, you know, we can get back to talk about games. I, I think it's crazy, but I, this is what I like when Microsoft is pushing the industry forward, it has the leading, bleeding tech, you know, technology and tech, you know what I mean? Um, hold on, hold on one second. All right, I'm back. You see this? I remember when this bad boy here came out, right? I had a hard drive, internet port. I was able to put a CD in it, and, 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 and I was able to rip the music to the hard drive, and the music played when I was playing my game, and and and, and it, it that blew my mind. That's the Microsoft that I fell in love with. And 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 Phil, the Xbox Scorpio is your baby. You know what I mean? So this is your you're you're the captain of this ship. You're the Titanic. You know what I'm you're gonna you're gonna either float or sink with this ship here. And I feel like Microsoft is going back. To that, you know what I mean? You know, be the behemoth that you are. For native 4K gaming, you know what I mean? You you know, Phil, you know what I mean? Just be real. They 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 they, they, they punish this Xbox fans, you know, about our games being 900 p um, Just to be on Phil, Phil, I've heard some of the most craziest resolution this generation, 792p. But again, no one has a 900p television. I buy a TV every two years. Uh, but now you guys are pushing HDR. Um, and, and I, like I said, Phil, I, I take my hat off and you and commend you. This is what I want you guys. I want nothing but the best from you guys. And I'm not here to kiss your butt or to, to stroke your ego in this video. But listen, if I'm mad enough to, you know, to give you carrots about the things that you don't do, that I feel as you do wrong, I'm also going to, you know, be mad enough to say the things that you're doing right. You know what I mean? But you still got to make up for my fable being gone. I'm still feel some type of way about that. But listen, man, I, 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 great things are ahead uh, for the us Xbox fans. I feel it in my, I feel it in my bones, and um, I'm happy, man. Like I say, um, say, say hi to Phil. Say hello. Say hello, Phil Spencer. You know who Phil Spencer is. You know who Phil Spencer is. He's running for president. He's the president out of where? Uh, of the video game world, yeah. The most powerful console ever. He feels though the egg. You know what the Xbox Scorpio is? What's your favorite X? What's your favorite console? Tell, tell what's your favorite game? Um. What's your favorite system? Pago. On uh, what system? What do you play Pago on? What's what's that? Xbox. All right. So you Xbox and Xbox. You hear that? You heard it here from the lady of the house over here. But anyway, as I was saying, man. Main kid in the house. Uh, the main okay, the main kid in the house. If I'm like I said, I'm mad enough to give you um, you know, you know when you, I feel like you're doing wrong or whatever. And also, like I said, I, I, I thank you guys, and, and, and I, I even tweeted you at the E3. I said, you know, you made us Xbox fans proud. You really, uh, one second, baby, one second, I got you. I'm going to deal for you. I, I, you, you. You really nailed home the fact that, hey, you know, you've been listening to us and to the fans, you know what I mean? And, you know, uh, all you got to do now, you bring in the, the, the most powerful console, and just, uh, just don't forget about the IPs and the games, man, you know? Uh, and I'm excited, like I said, to be an Xbox gamer. I'm going to buy me the Slim. I'm going to get me a recall look the beautiful, Phil. I, I get, like I said in the day, man, that's to me what the Xbox needs. Uh, because when people think of the Xbox, they think of just shooters, racers, you know what I mean? The Gears, the Halo, the Forzas, you know, but like I said, recall is a step in the right direction. I got, I got a present for Phil. What's the, what's the present you got for Phil? Uh, okay, all right. All right, here's a present for Phil. All right. But anyway, I'm not going to make this video too long. But like I said, anything, uh, hat off. You guys did a great job. You and the Microsoft team at E3. Um, uh, like I said, I was rooting for you guys. Uh, next to Gamescom, please don't bring no Minecraft. No more indies. Bring the guns, man. And um, yeah, Xbox Scorpio for the win, man. Xbox is the best box. And 
we out of here, man. And as I always say, bang bang. <laughs> Damn, no. We out of here, man. Say peace. Peace out. Bye bye. Bye bye.